static electricity It's just moving to the stars What is going on everybody, I am back again, and this video is actually going to be a Mobile Legends video. I usually post Call of Duty ones, but I'm still going to post Call of Duty, I just thought I'd try something new really quick. But yeah, so this video is going to be about how to, you know, level up your character in the game or whatever you want to call it, and you know, how to like farm the, the gold and all that stuff so you can become the strongest in the game. And I'll explain a little bit more in a second, but if you do enjoy the video, make sure to like, and if you're new, subscribe, because there's definitely going to be a lot more, but let's go ahead and get into it. So what I mean by level up was, you know, so you can level up so you can get the 15. So you can max out your abilities and you can just be a higher level than all the other people. Because when you're a higher level, say you're like three or four levels higher than somebody, if you run into them in a 1v1, you're most likely going to kill them as long as you're not like a bad player. Like towards the end of this game, I'm four, at least four levels higher than most people. I was, I think I was five at the very, very end. But yeah, so I made sure that I leveled myself up pretty good. I had all my abilities before other people did and I'm gonna go ahead and tell you how so basically what you want to do is you know when a game first starts you kind of want to go into a lane by yourself like you know the three lanes they have the top middle down you know I don't know I said that you already know <laughs> but yeah so you want to go into one of them probably by yourself just so your teammates can't take any of the minion kills and you want to go kill the minions and then once the minions are dead what I usually do is I go into a jungle and um, I'll go kill some of the I'll go kill some of the monsters or whatever it is, so I can level up. And then usually around that time, more of the minions will come back, and I'll go kill the minions again. And then if there's like a player over there, I'll shoot them. Or if there's like two enemy players, I'll just go to a different lane really quick. Or sometimes I'll stay there and shoot at them. But you don't want to like try to go for kills right when the game first starts. You definitely want to try to make sure you can get your character leveled up, because if you're leveled up, yeah, you might be able to kill them at the beginning. But I mean, if you're leveled up, like towards the end of the game, it's going to be a lot easier to, be able to kill them, and you're going to be higher than them. So, you know, don't really worry about trying to get kills right now. Just try to worry about killing the minions, and then running back and getting the, um, and getting the jungle monsters or whatever they're called. So many times in games, you just see either teammates or enemy players, they just go and try to kill people, which doesn't make sense to me, because when they're out trying to, like, kill each other and pretty much getting nowhere, just shooting, running back, shooting, and running back. I'm leveling up my character, I'm getting my abilities, I'm getting gold and everything, I'm becoming a stronger player, and usually towards the end of the game, not many people can beat me one-on-one, -on -one. usually people can't beat me one-on-one, -on -one, cause 9 times out of 10, I'm at least like 2 levels higher than them, unless they have like a smart enemy and he does the same thing I do, but most people don't and they try to go for towers and kill people, it is important to shoot the towers and you know, kill people sometimes, but you definitely want to like, make sure that you can level yourself up a little bit more before like usually I don't even try to kill people like kill them by myself until I'm like level 8 or usually around like 8 depending on what character I'm using but for like Layla I'm definitely like level 8 and I like to have like my attack speed up and all that stuff just cause she shoots pretty slow without it and it's really good to just make sure you you get the minions you kill the jungle monsters and if you see somebody that's weak or something or you know or they just like keep messing with you you can kill them then but don't intentionally go out trying to kill people and then trying to destroy towers right away. Unless you get like a group of like two or three people together like I have right now. And we have the minions. So yeah, we want to go destroy some towers. And I'm level 9 right now too. I just leveled up to 9. So it's a pretty good time right now. Like you're going to notice it's about to be the end of the gameplay pretty soon. You're going to notice that me and my team, but mostly me, um, I'm a lot higher level. Like look, that dude's a level 6. I'm a level 9. He, he wouldn't even stand a chance against me in a one-on-one. -on -one. I know we're different characters, but I use Layla pretty good, and not many people can kill me when I'm using her by myself, or when they're by themselves one-on-one, -on -one. and it's just, it's really, it's like so important just to kill the minions, kill the jungle monsters, and you know, you can kill the enemy if you have to, but I hate when my teammates, they just go straight, like run up the middle or whatever, they try to, they try to kill towers, and they try to kill players or whatever, and it's just, it really bothers me. And they just need to learn that, you know, you have to level yourself up first. You got to kill the jungle monsters. You got to kill the minions. You just got to, you know, you got to make sure you build your character up first because it might be kind of slow and boring at the beginning, but towards the end like this, when it really counts, like, look, I just destroyed that dude. It really just helps you and your teammates out. And I usually win a lot more games than I lose whenever I do this. Some games I have like a slow start to it though, and I can't really kill that many minions. 
and it's definitely a big difference at the end and I can tell I'm I'm a little bit weaker and then sometimes I'll die but look I'm three levels higher than this dude again and he go ahead and tries to run but still go ahead and kill him and everything but that's pretty much gonna wrap up what I have to say in this video but before it ends, I just want to say I'm going to be having more Mobile Legends content out, that's for sure. It's a fun game, you know, it's a phone game, but it's pretty fun. And I don't know, I just thought I'd try something new on my channel. Because Call of Duty's getting kind of, like, like boring. I don't know. I don't really like the new Call of Duty that, that much. So I thought I'd go ahead and try something different. But if you did enjoy the video, how I said earlier, make sure to like and if you're new, subscribe. And I'll definitely have more of these videos out soon. And hope you all have a good day, and I'm out. Peace.